Hey, this is Brett, and this 2019 Ram 2500 Crew Cab Short Box Laramie Level 1 package is stock number 14061ZA. I am here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used Ram and Heavy Duty Truck Headquarters. This 2019 Ram 2500 has the 6.7 liter Cummins diesel engine. It is paired up with the six-speed 68 RFE automatic transmission. This truck has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop per the state of Wisconsin inspection process. It has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off and this truck is 100% ready to go. I'm gonna go all the way around in this video, inside, underneath, start it up, take a look under the hood, show you all the options, and just give you the most accurate representation that I can of the vehicle. Granite Crystal Metallic is the color. I shoot all my videos in 4K. If you like the video, subscribe to the YouTube channel, click the bell notifications, get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as have access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle walkarounds on YouTube, and stay updated on our ever-changing and vast heavy-duty truck inventory here at Summit Auto. This one comes with the 18-inch polished aluminum wheels. It has BF Goodrich All-Terrain TA KO2 tires. These are LT275 70 R18s. I'd say they have right around half the tread left on them. Frame and underbody's in pretty nice shape. Just a little bit of corrosion by the uh, welds there, but nothing bad. And uh, this is a two owner, clean title history, clean Carfax out of Iowa. Front fender is in excellent condition, no dents or dings on there. You get the LED headlamps, LED running lights, and LED fog lamps. I will turn all those on at the end of the video so you can see just how bright they are. You do get the front bumper parking sensors as well, and you have your um, engine block heater cord there. It does have one little ding on the front bumper, but that does not affect the performance of the truck. You get the chrome trimmed grille, and the hood is in excellent shape as well. Didn't see any major dents or dings on there. Passenger side front fender is in pretty nice condition. Didn't see any dents or dings. There is one tiny little scratch right there, but nothing too bad. Passenger side front wheel is in excellent shape. Granite Crystal Metallic, one of my favorite colors on the Rams, has a lot of metal flake in it. Uh, you get some purples and some greens in that metal flake. Really a good looking color, and you can see just how nice that paint is as well. Now as you go down this side of this 2019 Ram 2500, take note of how clean the body is, and once again how reflective and mirror-like that paint is. I take these HD videos, so if you are far away or even if you're close by and you just cannot make the trip down, but you're still interested in purchasing the vehicle, you can see the truck, hear the truck, and have confidence in the vehicle that you're looking at before you even get here. So when you do get here, there's absolutely no surprises and you can make a smart and informed buying decision from wherever you're at. If this video helps you make that buying decision, let your salesman know that you saw the video, it was helpful and that Brett sent you. Back wheel's in nice shape as well. Back tires have just as much tread as the front tires, maybe even a little bit more, probably 50 to 60% of the tread on those tires. Frame and underbody is in pretty nice shape. It has all the remaining factory exhaust, so it hasn't been altered in any way. And the underbody all looks pretty good. Just a little bit of corrosion on those surface welds under there as well. Uh, lower rockers look really good, didn't see any corrosion on them and the cab corners and it does have the factor, or nice aftermarket painted step bars. Passenger side box, no dents or dings on that. LED tail lamps coming around to the back. The rear bumper is in great shape. I didn't see any dents or dings in there. It does have the backup parking sensors. Full towing package, which includes a receiver hitch, four pin and seven pin wiring. And the tailgate is in really nice condition as well. Didn't see any major dents or dings on there. You get the shock down assist tailgate, so it's never gonna slam down on you. Spray and bed liner, fifth wheel and gooseneck prep package. It does have the gooseneck ball in there. You get seven pin wiring, side box tie downs, and uh, the LED bed lights back here. Spray and bed liner goes onto the tailgate, which is a pretty nice feature. That shuts nice and solidly. And as we go down the driver's side, just as clean as that passenger side, no major dents or dings on the box. And for full disclosure, this back wheel is in excellent shape as well. 
Down the rest of the side of the truck, cab and doors all look really good. Once again, no more, no major dents or dings on there. It does have the heated fold up tow mirrors, blind spot monitoring, built in directional signals. They fold up like so. They also fold in like that. This one does have the 360 camera system. You also have LED side lights. I'll turn those on at the end of the video so you can see how bright those are as well. Take a quick look at the back seats. No major rips or tears back here. It does have the leather and suede seats. You do have the power sliding rear window with the built-in rear defrost. Get the gray piping on there. You also have a load floor back here, which is really nice. You got muddy boots or tools, put them on there. You're not going to get your seats dirty. Or if you got pets, put both sides down. They got a nice place to lay and they won't get your seats dirty. There are your caps for that fifth wheel and gooseneck prep package. Two USBs, two USB-Cs and 115 volt, 400 watt plug-in. You get the Berber floor mat back here. And in-floor storage on each side with removable bins for the easy cleaning. You can put ice and drinks in there. It's like you have too many coolers wherever you go, or if you're not in Wisconsin, just extra storage space. You do get um, side curtain airbags on those front seats. Child safety locks on the back doors and the inside and bottoms of the doors all look fantastic. Show you the VIN sticker here. No previously owned in Canada trucks here. And the tire and loading information sticker. Up front, the Laramie Level 1 package gives you the black leather bucket seats. You get the suede inserts. You get the Laramie stitched into the backrest. Gray piping on there. No rips, no tears. Both these seats are heated and cooled. Carpet floor mats up front, auto headlamps, power pedals, power windows, locks, and mirrors. You get the suede bolster on the door, the wood grain trim, memory driver's seat. These mirrors do power fold in. I always like showing both sides so that you know that both sides are working properly. And then you get power blind spot mirror, which is pretty cool. You can actually control that outside mirror on both mirrors, which is a bigger deal on the passenger side to be able to adjust that mirror. Hop inside, check out the miles, radio, and everything this one has to offer on the interior. You can see this one has 62,548 miles. You do get a digital speedometer on there on that 7-inch LCD display, outside temp display, compass display. You can change those corners to read whatever you want. And yes, we will be putting some fuel in this truck right after this video. Comes with a heated leather-wrapped steering wheel, cruise controls, and gear select on the right. Bluetooth and information center controls on the left and audio controls on the back of the steering wheel. There's your shifter for that six speed 68 RFE automatic transmission, push button start, push button four wheel drive. You get the 8.4 4C radio. This one does have AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities on it. You also get your climate controls on here, which includes your dual climate controls. You also have your heated and cooled seat buttons, as well as your heated steering wheel controls. And then you get your uh, surround view camera here. The only thing to really disclose on this truck is that the front camera is inoperative. So um, everything else works except that front camera, uh, but we do have that disclosed. You can see your backup camera there. You get a wide view of the back, and then uh, you can also check out your cargo cam, which is a sweet thing. And then you can also do down the sides. I wish my truck had this particular camera system on it because you can go down the sides of the truck. So if you're backing up a camper, trailer, or boat, um, be super helpful to see down that side. And then of course your regular backup cam and you can zoom in on that receiver hitch to get hooked up to the boat camper or trailer the first time, every time. There's your Alpine Premium Sound badge. And then um, all your other apps are on here as well. This one does have projection manager where you can project your cell phone to the screen via Android Auto or Apple CarPlay. So while this one doesn't have the factory navigation system, project your phone up there with Waze or Google Maps or some other nav system. It's like you have nav right in the screen. We did a demo on Android Auto if you want to check that out. That is in the upper right hand part of the screen on an 8.4 um, 4C radio. Down here, your more tactile volume tune and climate controls, including those heated and cooled seat buttons. Your dual climate controls right there. Factory brake controller, factory exhaust brake, tow haul mode, front and rear parking sensors right there. You can turn those off and on. CD player, two USBs, two USB-Cs, and an AUX jack, keyless entry with remote start and power drop down tailgate. You get the dual glove boxes, passenger side floor mat and seat are in excellent condition. 
and you get the speaker in the ceiling, speakers in the ceiling, and the headliners in really nice condition as well. You also have map lights, power side and rear window controls, and your power drop down tailgate control there. Auto dimming mirror and home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lighting systems. Let's start it up and take a look under the hood. Starts right up, no check engine lights or anything like that. There are those LED side lights. They are very bright, working nicely. I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today and hopefully from this HD video, you've been able to verify the quality and condition of this truck all the way around inside and out. All those LED lights are working nicely. And under the hood, we have this 6.7 liter Cummins diesel engine. Engine bay is very clean, runs very smooth. Once again, this truck has been fully safety and inspected by our, our service shop has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off, and this truck is 100% ready to go. There is the emissions sticker. And I would highly recommend this truck from a quality and condition standpoint, and other than the front camera not working, this thing's in really nice shape and everything works nicely. And to see more pictures of this truck or one of our other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, half tons, three quarter tons, one tons, you name it, we got to go to the website right there, summitauto.com, full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle, all at summitauto.com. If you want to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto, click the bell notifications, get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle and heavy duty truck walkarounds on YouTube. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to all the Ram 2500 truck videos I've ever done in the upper right, a link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out. We're super excited to help you with this ultra clean 2019 Ram 2500 Crew Cab Short Box Laramie Level 1 in granite crystal metal. Thank you so much for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. Thanks again, and have a great day.